And basically, what I was saying, we are very privileged, 349 people, to make decisions for 40 million Kenyans. We are very privileged. We are among the most educated Kenyans. We have the best exposure, courtesy of our communities. And I think this is honorable, this honorable is member for Makweni. Honorable member for Makweni, address the chair. Address the Madam, chair. Madam Chair, this is by those particular statistics I've already given you. This presents a house of honor, a house of respect, a house representing all the Kenyans, despite the political divide. When a Kenyan dies, there is no blood that is Wuda, there is no blood that is ODM, there is no blood that is Kenya Kwanzaa. Whole blood is red, and all blood is for Kenyan citizens. Madam Honorable Speaker, I am very disappointed when I see honorable members thinking the death of any Kenyan, whether the Kenyan is coming from Makweni, whether the Kenyan is coming from Luoland, whether the Kenyan is coming from Kikuyu, and death of any Kenyan must worry us as representatives. So when the deaths of people do not worry us, Madam Speaker, I, I feel as a person, we are, I feel as a house, we are degrading our status that this nation has actually given to us to make decisions on behalf of the 50 million Kenyans. Madam Speaker, I once worked in South Sudan and I thought it was crazy. When one time I, take my, I took my colleague who had an accident to a, a, a mediation place by the government. And the person who was mediating said, we are going to jail you, Kenyan, because if you did not leave Kenya, this accident would not have happened. I thought that was very absurd until I heard, this, heard it, Madam Speaker, in this honorable house. When somebody says, you would not have been killed if you were not on the street. I think there is no law in this country, there is no law in this country even that allows anybody to be killed because you were found somewhere still. of order, leader of majority? There are methods that are actually can be used. Honorable, no, Honorable can I Speaker, continue? The, the, member, the member on her feet is quoting... <laughs> what is out of order? Honorable Speaker, I was waiting for the ones who have a trophy in shouting to finish shouting, then I articulate my point of order. The member who was on her feet, clearly articulating very good points about incidences in South Sudan, is alleging that a member, without naming that member, and if I remember, Honorable Speaker, Honorable Speaker, if you can protect me from these ones.